Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are watching this out there on the World Wide Web. This is Jeremy Geenan for Syscon TV. I'm here at 10th Cloud Expo, Cloud Expo New York, right next to me, Lawrence Guillory, CEO of the moving company for the cloud, Rasimi. Good to see you, Lawrence. Good to see you, Jeremy. I haven't caught up with you guys for seven months. Lots going on as ever. Let's back up and make sure, let's unpack that. The moving company for the cloud, I remember it. Most of the world remembers it. How do you unpack that when you're talking to real customers though? Right, it's, uh, it's really simple. So uh, uh, customers, you know, let's back up from an industry standpoint. From an industry standpoint, let's back up even further. <laughs> Start again. This, this is the best. This, <laughs> Not necessarily. I just want to compliment. I oh. I think this is the best Cloud Expo yet. Uh, we've been uh, uh, showing here seven, this is our seventh Expo. Yeah, you really are. And, and it gets better and better. And, uh, and, I, and, I, and that helps make this next point is uh, the market is maturing. And, and, I, and I, I like to go back to the early adopter phase. And now I, I, I firmly believe uh, for a period of time now, we're in the early mainstream adoption phase. And the mainstreamers are looking for something different. In the meantime, from an industry standpoint, thankful from a Racemi standpoint, has been to our benefit, all of these great cloud platforms forgot about an onboarding solution. So when it comes to what is Racemi and the moving company for the cloud, we solve that problem. So when a customer has decided, I want a private cloud or I want a public cloud, regardless of the platform, that's when you call Racemi. We'll come in, capture their existing server images, migrate them into that private or public cloud. Now our technology knows on the fly that this new environment is indifferent from where they're starting. So they may need device driver changes, they may need registry level changes, they may need a hypervisor conversion, they may go from VMware to Zen or Zen to Hyper-V or Hyper-V to KVM or any of those differences. They may need cloud tools injected. Uh, they may need also uh, things taken out of the software or even management software put on top of it when it gets in there. Uh, it's amazingly complex and having to do that by hand for all of the applications that are targeted to move in the cloud uh, is impossible to do without technology. And that's what Racemi does. We have a purpose-built uh, application that does this. Uh, on the fly, recognizes the differences, makes those technical changes on the uh, fly, so that the new app, so the application works in the new cloud environment, uh, and that's why we're the moving company for the cloud. And you know, one sort of simple question. I hope it's not too basic. I've got to know where my workloads need to be, right? Just like if I'm moving, I'm the one who says where the new address is. I'm, you don't have to consult or worry about that, I'm telling you, but you're going to get me there. Right, and you know, from a net networking standpoint, for example, uh, our system has the intelligence to know that your IP settings uh, uh, need to uh, uh, change, your, your VLAN settings need to change. We adapt for all that and make it happen. Uh, you may want your system to point back to, to the same LUN. We'll do that and, and reestablish with your data. Uh, and, you know, where's the future? So the future is, from a Racemi standpoint, is migrating complex apps. You've got multi-tiered apps. Uh, five servers, 10 servers, 25 servers working for these large multi-tier complex apps. And we do the discovery up front to see how they work together. We capture them, migrate them into the cloud, lay them down in the proper order, reconnect them in the, in the, in the proper uh, order so that the new application works uh, uh, on whole uh, with all the different servers working together as intended. Uh, and that's pretty radical. Uh, and we've got new uh, pending patent in, in that area as well. Now, what's changed in the past seven months, uh, uh, we've come out of stealth mode with, with a SaaS-based offering. Uh, it's called CloudPath. So you can go to Racemi, click on CloudPath, and what CloudPath will do is it, from any browser, you can capture any server image in the world, anywhere in the data center. It takes less than one minute to initiate the process, capture that server image, and migrate it into the most major public clouds in the world. Amazon, Rackspace, Terramark, GoGrid, and you know, in seven months, it'll be another 12, 15, yeah. 25 other clouds that we're going to add into that capability. It's a, it's a, it's an incredible addition to the product that we have, where we've got one that you can bring into your firewall and build a fully automated private uh, cloud with. Uh, if you're an MSP or cloud provider, you can take this same technology and use it for onboarding customers uh, uh, between your different products, whether it's a dedicated colo cloud 
whatnot, give them those same capabilities, and uh, and and then from a hybrid standpoint, uh, Racemi's there as well, allowing images to be on premise uh, and off premise for whatever the uh, use case might be. So you really have, as ever, gotten ahead of where this is going, and you want people to understand that from Racemi. How do we convince them? We can send them to Racemi.com, but how else? We, you're evangelizing as much as you're doing the engineering side of this, because you really are driving the market. Sure. Um, you know what? I tell you, I just thought of this. No approval for marketing. Mention this video, or send a link to this video, and we'll do the first migration for free. I like that. Can't beat that. So we'll get you in the cloud, less than a minute to do the process. 20 minutes later, you migrate it in the cloud. We'll do it free of charge. Uh, and if you need help running the software, which is so intuitive, uh, we'll gladly show you how to use it. So there you are. How about that for an invitation? Quote this interview. Name Lawrence Guillory, say, but the boss said, and they will honor it at Racimo. That's pretty nice. Tweet about that. <laughs> I'll tweet about it too. Racimo.com right now. Say Lawrence sent you. Thank you for talking with us yeah. again. See you on the West Coast. And thank you again, audience, for uh, watching this out there on the World Wide Web.